everybody, and welcome to another episode of Off the Cuff. Now, my episodes vacillate between dinners, lunches, or breakfasts, savory or sweet, desserts, main courses, but today, we're definitely leaning on the savory side. I'm a member of a whole lot of groups online, and one of the questions I see all the time is, what savory treat can I have that's crunchy and salty? That's a great question. I've been looking for that answer, too, and you know what? Yesterday, it came to me. It did, but from an unexpected place. I was watching Family Slides. Yeah, now if you're under 40, slides are a little picture that are kind of encased in a white cardboard that looks like a saltine, and they're projected onto a screen. You know what? Before I get to the answer, I think I'm going to show you some of the slides I watched yesterday. They're, they're from me growing up, dealing with my, my weight and my family and my body attitude. Actually, it's a lot of fun. So I'm just going to show you a few, okay? I still have the projector set up. Hey, uh, turn on the projector. Beautiful. Here we go. Ah, this is me. One week old. I was five pounds, two ounces. My mom said I could fit in a shoebox. <laughs> that didn't last long. One year later, it took both my brother and my sister to lift me off the ground. What can I say? My family loved food. So much that on Thanksgiving, we each got our own individual turkeys. <laughs> my mother didn't think I could handle it. Wrong. All gone. Hey, my first kiss, Hershey's. I'm not sure what that is. That's either my Mr. Rogers period or, oh my God, I have no neck period. Uh, this is when my entire elementary school had a celebration when I got my cholesterol under 200. One, nine. Next slide. Well, this is easy to explain. When you're 12 and somebody says, hey, whip out those puppies. You, uh, whip out those, those puppies. And here is our answer. Me and Pickles the Clown. I love Pickles the Clown and I love Pickles. And that's your answer. Pickles are a perfect, low carb, savory, salty, crunchy treat. They have nearly no carbs. So today, I'm gonna to show you how to make your own pickles. Now, I like half sour or salty pickles. So I'm gonna show you how to make your own half sour salty pickles. And then, and then, I'm gonna show you how to make air fried pickles. Oh, such a treat, so easy to do. And you can do it in an oven. I'll give you those instructions too. So here we go, it's all about pickles. My dad, he was jealous of Pickles the Clown. Nice try, Dad. Here are the ingredients. Let's start off by making our half sour pickles. You'll need two or three large cucumbers, four cups of water, one quarter cup of kosher salt, six cloves of garlic crushed and you don't have to peel them, one tablespoon of pickling spice, and two to four sprigs of fresh dill. All right, now let's make our low carb air fried pickle spears. You need six pickle spears, one cup pork panko, one quarter cup almond flour, one half teaspoon garlic powder, two eggs, two tablespoons heavy cream, and salt and pepper to taste. Okay, I have my whole pickling station set up, the water, the cucumbers, the salt, the garlic, the pickling spice, the dill, and the mason jar. Now to measure these, because they have to fit in here, what I do, put these to the side, is I do that. And I take, so I'm gonna go from here to here, so I take a knife there, and cut there. This pickle will fit inside. These are our correct size cucumbers. We're gonna dissolve our salt into our water. So here's the quarter cup of kosher salt. And we just stir. 
This will absorb actually pretty fast. Now let's start filling up this jar. Here's the six cloves of garlic. They are crushed. You don't have to unwrap them. Don't worry about it. In. The pickling spice. In. See, there you go, fresh dill. And it goes. Now for our pickles, we're gonna do spears. So there's one, two, it should take two and a half pickles, I would guess. And there's your first pickle into spears. Not, no relation to Brittany. And we start putting it in. Now Brittany Spears is going through her mind. Oops, I did it again. Yeah, I'm a good singer. Okay, you want to pack them in just about like that. Introducing the funnel. Take our brine. We're not going to use all of this. You see that? See up there? There you go. Our pickles are ready to go. Now, seal. Yes. Now for the hard part. Now, this is the hard part because to become pickles, it needs one week at least in the refrigerator. It's tough to wait, so if you plan to do this, do it a week in advance. So, see you in a week. Well, that's long enough. <laughs> I actually did this a week ago. I'm schmott. Okay, before we get started with the pickle spears, we have to make our pork panko. I've done this before in the show. It's just three easy steps. Step one. Place it in an oven. Preset to 350 degrees for 10 minutes. Step two. Remove from the oven. Step three. Pulverize. <laughs> the pork panko is done. Now let's make those air fried pickle spears. Now I took the almond flour, the garlic powder, the salt and pepper, and mixed it all together here. Our egg and our heavy cream. Let's do that now, mix it in. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take the spear this one, I'll name it Brittany. L-I-D. Sorry, I'm sorry, I'm stuck on that now. Into the almond flour, just roll it. Roll, roll, roll. Cover it like this. Now into the egg. Let it drip off. And into the pork panko. Panko power. Don't forget to spray so it doesn't stick. And our first pickle spear is in. Now repeat four to six times. I'm gonna do five. Okay, I, I got my size proportions wrong. I'm only gonna be able to do four of these. That's fine in the air fryer. Doing it for 15 minutes at 400 degrees. Let's go. Okay, into the big air fryer. There you go, our pickles. 400 degrees for 15 minutes. Now, if you want to do this in an oven, you certainly can. In an oven, use a cookie sheet. You can use parchment paper or not. Same amount of time, 15 minutes for 450 degrees, and you can do it in an oven. In 14 minutes and 30 seconds, I'm going to be having air fried pickles. Pickles the clown, eat your heart out. There you go, homemade half sour pickles and homemade air fried half sour pickle spears. I'll put this down for now. Now you'll get the crunch, I promised, and the saltiness here. Here, this is a different story. This is really easy to make. It's super low carb and it's super satisfying. You can use it as a snack. You can use it as a side. You can use it as whatever. But I tell you, oh, they look so good. This reminds me of when I made um, I made avocado fries. These kind of look exactly the same, and I'm hoping they taste the same. But uh, like I said, low carb, low calorie. Just got to start a week ahead if you can do your own. Or if you like sour pickles, buy some. 
yeah, buy some pickles and do this. You absolutely can. Okay, now I'm going to taste this. I cannot, I cannot wait. Here we go. Oh, it's a crunchy bite. You taste the panko. The pickle is soft. It's gooey. It's delicious. It's salty. Me need more. This is absolutely delicious. You and your entire family and all your friends will gobble these up and not even realize it's good for them. Oh, baby. Well, that's it for this time around. Hey, if you would like a menu card for today's recipe, just email me at offthecuffcraig at gmail.com and I'll send you one. We're here again in about two weeks with another recipe. Until then, be well. Eat good.